everyone today we are going to evaluate the postfix expression in the previous lecture we discussed about how to convert infix to postfix or postfix to infix but sometimes you have given the examples like this and you have to ask to evaluate these expressions so today we are going to see few examples to evaluate the postfix expression so let's start from the very simple question the expression is given that is 7 2 plus 3 multiplication now we have to evaluate this we have to find out the answer here make two columns the first one is a symbol and second one is a stack now let's scanning symbol from left to right so the first symbol is 7 it goes into the stack the second symbol is 2 in stack we have 7 and then add 2 then the next symbol is plus now we start pushing the operands into the stack until the operator comes so here 7 and 2 are the operands we start pushing it into the stack now the operator comes so at the top of the stack we have 2 and 7 so we add 7 and 2 so the answer is 9 now the next symbol is 3 so here add 3 into the stack so we have in stack 9 and 3 and then it comes the multiplication so we have only two operands left so multiply these 9 into 3 that is a 27 so this is our final answer let's solve another example the another example is given as 3 4 5 multiplication plus now again make two columns the first one is a symbol and the second one is a stack now start pushing the operands into the stack until the operator comes so the first symbol is 3 it goes into the stack next one is a 4 now in stack we have 3 and 4 next is a 5 in stack we have 3 4 and 5 the next symbol is multiplication so here multiplication and the top of the stack are 4 and 5 so multiply 4 and 5 so the answer is in stack we have 3 and 20 4 multiply by 5 that is a 20 now the next symbol is the last one that is a plus now we have only two operands left 3 and 20 so add both these operands so the answer is 23 so this is our final result let's see another example the expression given as 1 2 3 multiplication plus 4 minus now again we have two columns symbol and stack we start pushing the operands into the stack until the operator comes the first symbol is 1 added into the stack second one is 2 again added into the stack third one is a 3 again add it into the stack okay now the next symbol comes that is a operator now we have at the top of the stack 3 and 2 so we multiply 3 and 2 and that is a 6 now the next symbol is plus so we have only two operands in our stack so write down 1 plus 6 that is a 7 then it comes 4 so add it into the stack so in stack we have 7 and 4 then the operator comes that is a minus now 7 minus 4 that is equal to 3 so this is our final result for the above postfix expression let's see another example 2 3 multiplication 4 multiplication now the first symbol is 2 it gets added into the stack the second one is 3 now in stack we have 2 and 3 the next one is a multiplication so in stack we have only two operands 2 and 3 so multiply both operands that is a 6 then it comes the 4 so here in stack we have 6 and 4 then multiplication so multiply both the operands 6 into 4 that is a 24 so this is our final answer for the above postfix expression let's see another example 10 2 8 multiplication plus 3 minus start pushing operands into the stack until operator comes so the first symbol is 10 it is an operand it goes into the stack second one is a 2 so in stack we have 10 and 2 next one is a 8 so our stack has 10 2 and 8 the next symbol is multiplication now at the top of the stack we have 2 and 8 so here we have 10 and 2 into 8 that is a 16 the next symbol is a plus 
now we have only two operands left so 10 plus 16 that is a 26 the next symbol is 3 so in stack we have 26 and 3 then we have minus now 26 minus 3 that is equal to 23 so this is our answer let's see another example 2 3 4 plus multiplication 5 multiplication now the first symbol is 2 it goes into the stack the second one is a 3 again it goes into the stack next one is a 4 it goes into the stack now the next symbol is operator top of the stack are 4 and 3 so here 3 plus 4 is equal to 7 then the next symbol is multiplication we have only two operands in our stack so 2 multiplied by 7 that is equal to 14 next symbol is a 5 so in stack we have 14 and 5 and the last symbol is multiplication so only two operands left so 14 multiplied by 5 that is equal to 70 so this is our answer for the above postfix expression okay let's solve another example 2 3 4 multiplication 6 division plus now the first symbol is 2 it goes into the stack second one is a 3 again it goes into the stack then 4 so in stack we have 2 3 and 4 the next symbol is multiplication so top of the stack are 4 and 3 so 2 as it is 3 multiplied by 4 that is equal to 12 the next symbol is 6 it goes into the stack so in stack we have 2 12 and 6 then comes the division so 2 as it is and top of the stack are 12 and 6 so 12 divided by 6 that is equal to 2 now the next symbol is plus we have only two operands left and we reach up to the end of expression so 2 plus 2 is equal to 4 so this is our final answer now let's see the last example the expression is given as 2 5 3 multiplication 12 2 2 exponential division 5 multiplication minus plus let's start scanning the symbol from left to right so the first symbol is 2 it goes into the stack second one is a 5 it again goes into the stack next symbol is 3 so in stack we have 2 5 and 3 then we have multiplication so here 2 as it is top of the stack are 5 and 3 so 5 multiplied by 3 that is equal to 15 next symbol is 12 so here in stack we have 2 15 and 12 next symbol is 2 so here we have 2 15 12 and 2 the next one is again 2 add it into the stack so we have 2 15 12 2 and 2 the next one is a exponential now 2 as it is 15 then 12 top of the stack are 2 and 2 so 2 exponential 2 that is equal to 4 now the next symbol is division so here 2 15 then top of the stack are 12 and 4 so 12 divided by 4 that is equal to 3 the next symbol is 5 so here we have 2 15 3 and 5 5 is added into the stack then we have multiplication so here we have 2 15 3 into 5 that is equal to 15 the next symbol is minus now here we have 2 then top of the stack are 15 and 15 so 15 minus 15 that is equal to 0 then we have plus so only two operands left and we reach up to the end of expression so 2 plus 0 that is equal to 2 so this is our final result for the above postfix expression. I hope you understand these are the very simple questions. If you have any query regarding this topic or any other topic then let me know in the comment section.